This is not financial advice, not legal advice for entertainment and educational purposes only. And anything I say is my opinion. Please don't make any financial decision based on anything I say in these videos. That being said, hit the like button, subscribe button, all that YouTube algorithm stuff. So you get the videos I put them out. See what I'm thinking, see I'm analyzing that data. Like I tell every day, the day they release us is false. Man, it gives a false narrative of the markets. So we can make bad trading decisions. Listen, our buddy, our pal, Gary Gensler, had to testify before Congress today because of the MMTLP scam, the MMTLP criminal conspiracy, and he refused to take any responsibility for what FINRA did. He was asked direct questions, and this is just my opinion, my analysis of what he said. He danced around the questions, and I don't think Senator Mike Crapple was aggressive enough to get real answers out of Gary Gensler. And this is just my opinion. It appeared to be like a, a horse and pony show. That is where you go up there and you put on a good show to try to appease the masses, to make it look like you're doing something, when in reality you're doing absolutely nothing. When he was asked about FINRA violating the rules, if there was an investigation, he said that he doesn't control what FINRA does, that he's they FINRA puts rules in place, and then they, they decide, and then they, they, they send FINRA the rules, and, but they don't really watch if FINRA follow the rules. And then they do annual updates or annual checks, annual checks on FINRA to see if FINRA's following the rules. And then Senator Crapo asked them directly, are y'all investigating what happened with MMTLP? And then he started, well, you know, if there's an investigation undergoing, he started beating around the bush. The bottom line is this, and this is just my opinion. They are not going to do anything. Okay? They're not going to do anything. There's no investigation because everybody knows what happened. Everybody knows what FINRA did. The stock shouldn't have been traded in the first place. They didn't have authority to trade that stock. But they did it anyway because they don't have to follow the rules because there are no there are no regulatory agencies in the United States to protect retail investors. These big dogs, these big banks, these market makers, these hedge funds, they can do whatever they want. They can violate every single rule in the book. And at the end of the day, they walk away with our profits. And sometimes they get fined. And if enough people make a noise, if enough people make noise, then Congress gets involved. They bring Gary Gensler up there. They put on this, this horse and pony show or dog and pony show. They put this on to try to appease us, to make it look like they're doing their job. They're not doing anything. And in my opinion, Senator Cropple could have been a lot more aggressive with his questioning. I believe he let Gary Gensler off the hook. Just my opinion. Anyway, please leave some comments. Tell me what you think. Do you think that anything is going to happen with an MMTLP investigation with the SEC and FINRA? Anyway, have a great day. God bless, and I appreciate y'all on this journey with me.